Zatanna is a powerful magic user and appears to be the most powerful member of the Justice League Dark, or at least she is in the animated movie of the same title. In this movie, she casts several spells, some of which are devastatingly powerful. And though what she is saying sounds like gibberish, it is actually Zatanna saying her spells backwards. This is how her magic works. What she says backwards happens. Now, usually the writers just spell the words backwards on the page and then the actress reads them aloud. For example, levitate spelled backwards looks like this. And if you read it, it reads as itativel. Now this is used in such shows as Young Justice and Justice League Action. But for the Justice League Dark movie, the filmmakers decided to have her say the spells forwards and then reverse the audio so it sounds like she's talking backwards. Well, since the audio is reversed, she is technically talking backwards, but you know what I mean. Now, this makes it harder to translate the spells. In the past, when I translated Zatanna and Zatara spells for the Young Justice TV series, I was able to just look at the subtitles and reverse them. Incidentally, links to these videos are in this video's description. But the Justice League Dark film had no subtitles for the spells, and so I had to play the clips backwards and work out what she was saying, which is a lot of guesswork and was actually quite difficult, as it's still hard to make out the spells even when the audio is reversed, and it is possible they are just gibberish. But I have managed to translate the other spells as well as possible, and here they are. The first spells the town utters is on stage, where she makes three elephants disappear. Now, when this is reversed, it still sounds like a lot of gibberish, but after listening to it many times, I think she's saying, it's a terrible act, vanish. It's hard to make all the words, but I think the word vanish is fairly clear to hear. It's a terrible act, vanish. Now, it's a stretch to hear what I've said, but if you listen closely, you can just about hear it. It's a terrible act, vanish. And it's the only thing that makes sense because she is making the act vanish. But as I say, it could just be gibberish. Next, she makes a tree and some rocks disappear from the Batmobile's path. Don't and we play this clip backwards. Explode. To me, it sounds like she's saying explode. explode. And this does make sense as the tree and rocks do kind of explode. And if you listen, you can hear it. Explode. Next, she casts a spell as the Batmobile is swept into a tornado. This is hard to make out, but I think she is saying outward shielding. Since the spell makes a shield around the Batmobiles outside, this does make sense. Though, as I've said, these spells are very hard to hear and make out, but I can't actually see what else she could be saying. The next spell she does reveals Felix Faust's home. Now, I really can't make out what she was doing and what she was saying in this one. The closest I can get is something along the lines of Come Fortress Felix Reveal. That's as close as I can get to working out what she's saying, but your guess is as good as mine with this one. The last spell, thankfully, is a lot clearer. During the fight with Felix Faust, Satana loses control and begins to chant to destroy him. By reversing it, we're able to hear what this chant is. And though it is tricky at times to make out, what I think she's saying is, the hottest of cinders in the woven heart of hell, the banshee destroy him. Give me the demon bard, the banshee raiden, by all the dark hosts of Hades. The hottest of cinders in the woven heart of hell, the banshee destroy him. Give me the demon bard, the banshee raiden, by all the dark hosts of Hades. Now that one is quite clear, so I'm pretty sure that's what she is saying. And as I have said, all of this is guesswork because an official translation of the spells is yet to be released. So not all the words may be correct. This is just what they sound like to me when played backwards. But they may actually sound different to you and you may think that Zatanna is saying something else. And I do admit that I may be wrong. But if you think my translations are wrong and that what she is saying is something different, then please let us know in the comments, along with which spells you think that I've gotten right. And I'd just like to say a quick thank you to those of you who made this video possible by donating to Needle Mouse Productions' page on Patreon. Patreon is a crowdfunding site that is helping us to bring you more videos each week and helping us to raise funds to adapt comic book stories into short movies. And as always, thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe, share, like and comment.